What is up, everybody? It is Slayer Corpse here, and we are here with Dark Souls 3. Now, I already I already kind of explained this in the beginning of the stream, but I just wanted to say um, I've beaten Dark Souls 2 twice now, so I wasn't going to move to Dark Souls 3 till I beat Dark Souls 2, and I know I'm just saying it. And uh, you know, you're just going to have to take my word for it. I know I haven't streamed it or uploaded the videos, but that doesn't mean that I don't plan to, because honestly, I really, really enjoyed Dark Souls 2. Again, I've beat it twice now. Once as a mage, once as a strength build. So I'll either stream a strength build again, or I'll do something else. But anyways, just to let you guys know, sorry, I'm not, I'm not gonna make this intro super long. Just pretty much, um, I've played like an hour of Dark Souls three, and then I decided I want to stream it. So I kind of know what's going on for the first hour, just up until the first boss, like the fir not the f beginning area boss, but the first boss. I, at least I think it's the first boss, and then after that it'll be all new. So yeah, just a little quote unquote disclaimer. And, uh, yeah, let's get right into this. I'm gonna make a new character. <sighs> and, yeah. I think it's gonna do the- is it gonna do the intro yes, first? It is. Okay, indeed. I'll shut up. I really it like this intro, by the way. Northrip, where the transitory lands of the Lords of Cinder converge. In venturing north, it's the fucking finger readers, the finger butthole, you know. The truth Try finger butthole, sorry. <laughs> that kind of sounded weird without the context. The fire fades, and the lords go without thrones. I'm really, really excited to start this game. It's the most reminiscent to Elden Ring, in my opinion, just because it's like the third game in the series, closer to when Elden Ring came out. Oh my god, I love this shit. We have this fucking goopy slop dude. Are we gonna be some boss? I don't know. Aldrich, Saint of the Deep. And I don't think these are bosses, but they're like, they look cool. I think I think they're just area, area enemies. And this dude looks so badass, like, I hope we get to fight him eventually. I assume we will, but... He's badass as hell. Yes, sir. Only in truth? The Lords will abandon their thrones. And the unkindled will rise. It's our maiden. We're we're not maidenless in the beginning of Dark Souls 3, hell no, fuck that shit. Nameless, accursed, undead, unfit even to be cinder. Yeah, 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 whatever. And so it is that Ash seeketh embers. Is there? Okay. So I don't know exactly what kind of build I'm going to want to do, um, but my main thing is going to be strength. I, can, I think I like playing strength classes. Um, I don't like, I did my first playthrough of Dark Souls 2 as a mage, and it was fun, and I'll probably do the same mage for this game eventually, but for now I'm going to start off with the uh, warrior, because he's got like 16th strength. He's all, he's all good. Only starts off at level 7 too. So, alright, so we'll go warrior. Um... Yeah, we're gonna be male, we're gonna be young. 
Burial gift. I honestly don't know what's good for burial gift. All of them look pretty mid, so I'm probably just gonna go with the life ring. Um, face presets. Forgot which guy I liked. It was not that guy. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Okay, I like that. We'll just go with that. I don't really feel like fucking with it too much. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Hair color, we're gonna go red, obviously. Kind of, look, gonna kind of stick with a dark red. I don't want to go too bright, so I think that's good. Um, our brow. Let's see, I think that's a good brow right there. Looks a little bit angry. Um, same thing here. We're just gonna make everything red. He's gonna be, you know, how to slay your corpse and shit. My favorite, my favorite color is red, so. I'm gonna give him a scar. Let's go ahead and move this. We're gonna like put it over his eye. There we go. And it looks like he has a big ass wound. Looks like a badass. Okay, yeah, I think that's good. Um, I think that's pretty much it. I actually think I. Yeah, wait, how does that look compared to ours? Okay, not bad, because we're going to change his build, too. I almost got it right on. Ooh, actually, <laughs> I think I'm just going to go with the one I already created. I forgot that I saved it to favorites. Yeah, I think that's better with the with the scar placement. The eye and stuff, it pretty much looks exactly the same. Um, but yeah, we're going to go with this one, because he's a little bit more muscular and shit. I could have just... Uh, I didn't even need to go through all that. Okay. Um, Slayer, Corpse... Obviously, can't do anything else, and uh, let's let's get started. Let's start on this bitch. I got this on PS4 originally. I got the deluxe, but it was because it, it was only like 40. But um, it ended up being really bad, like super laggy. My dude was like wigging out all over the place. It just it just ended up not being good. So I ended up getting it on PC. So I'm actually really excited to play it on the PC compared to uh compared to the PS4 because <laughs> that shit was just atrocious. Is he wearing more your clothing? Oh, he is? Okay. The Cemetery of Ash. Okay. Let's get it. This game looks way better than Dark Souls 2. I really did like Dark Souls 2. I'm not gonna lie. Um, kind of sad that I beat that so fast, but... Um, I know this game's shorter in terms of, like, length and, uh... I don't know about the DLCs. I don't know if I'll, I'll probably play through the main game and then get the DLCs. I have to wait um, until I can get them because, like, I just started a new job. So, you already know how it is. Just starting to get paychecks and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, we have magic Estus flasks, which probably won't be using that much. Although, we do have very little magic. So, maybe we'll either just upgrade our ma I don't know. I don't want to upgrade our magic at all, and I don't want to use uh, flasks of magic. Yo, what's up? How, how's it going? It's been a minute on my part, and we're finally here with Dark Souls 3. We're gonna come over here and kill this guy. We're gonna do a little, a little yell here, or a little, Whoa! oh, he doesn't, he doesn't yell. We're gonna get this guy. Oops, missed that. Come on. Let's see if we can do a heavy. Oh, I thought he was going to hit there. Damn, that hit me? I'm actually surprised. Probably would help if I stayed locked on. Yeah, I saw that coming. Yeah, this we're like barely doing any damage to him, but we're going to get him. Okay, hell no. Nah. I'm going to wait for him to do some type of move. I don't want to die from our, like, third enemy. Oh shit, okay, now we're gonna back up and, uh... See what he does here. He's gonna... Okay, we're good to heal. We have, like, barely any heals right now. It feels so weird. Okay, do one more hit. Whatever you're gonna do. Of course you're gonna do that shit. Okay, that we should be good. Hey, we got him. Easy peasy. What we do with the Titanite scale, I have no idea. Um, but at least we have it right off the bat. So we're gonna take that soul. Nothing over here. Okay, cool. 
we'll be on our merry way. We're already out of Estus Flask, but that's fine. Because at least we're almost full health. And I think in this game we can at least allocate the flasks. Well, are they? Okay, they are called flasks. Let's come up here. This dude. Womp. Let's get whatever souls we can. This dude. Womp. He didn't have to do that. Little bitch ass. Alright. This game looks super good. I really like how that shit looks compared to the last game. Oh my gosh. And honestly, it wasn't that bad in Dark Souls 2, to be honest. It really wasn't. It was a big up <laughs> a big upgrade from Dark Souls 1, that's for sure. Alright, we got a bonfire here. Hit that. Let's hope we don't die, but we're gonna try to get uh, everything in this area first. Let's get this dude. And then we're gonna do this jump over here. Womp. Oh no! Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Of course. Of course. Alright, it's fine. We got this dude here. We got this guy here. Give me a little bitch. Does he pull out a sword? I don't know. Guess the world will never know. Alright. We're gonna have to sit at- Oh wait, I was gonna say we're gonna have to sit at the bonfire to reset it, but... I forgot. We don't have to sit at the bonfire to reset a jump. No. No, no. Quit being so fast. Okay, let's try this again. Let's not mess this up. Over here. No! Are you kidding me? Alright, alright. I'm not giving up. We got this. Do a run up here. Run around here. I can't tell what angle I need to jump off at. Okay, this one should be it. There we go. Titanite shard. Hey. That's what's up be able to upgrade our weapon a little bit. Alright, now we'll sit at the bonfire to reset our health. Because I don't want to go into this with the uh, with zero flasks. Kind of make a fool of myself. I was going to say, it sounds like somebody's walking around. We'll get him, we'll get him uh, when we come around. Okay, hey, we got a... Got an emote from that. That's what's up. Okay... This is probably the dude that was coming after us. Kind of weird. I, I don't think there's anything over here, is there? Oh, wait. Wait a second. Oh, shit. There is. Okay, but this is got a shield. That's no fair, so we're going to use a shield, too. Okay. Ooh, five firebombs. Let's get it. To be honest, I've never used the fire bombs or anything when I play, so maybe it'll help out. That guy's already dead. He's passed out. He's like, bro, leave me alone. Yeah, we gotta go this way. We got this guy. We got this guy again. Hmm, let's just get you. I don't want you getting in my way. Of course. Of course you're gonna hit me at the same time, for sure. Alright. Here we go, let's try this out. Let's hit one of these. Whoa! Just do the Kratos yell. Alright, let's start damaging this bitch ass. Okay, we... Damn, that was wide as fuck. I'm doing hella health on him, so I can't really complain. Nope. Not gonna deal with that. Oh wait, can I can I repost him? Damn it. No! No! One more hit, he's one tap. Ah! Okay, he's dead. Ah damn it. Is this your first run at Dark Souls 3? Yes sir, I uh I streamed like an hour of it the other night, but it was like super late. My girlfriend was over, so I kind of know what to do up to the first boss, but that'll be about it. This is pretty much a first run. It, it is, but like, <laughs> I just know again about like the first hour of it. Up to like the frost, dude. But that's about it. That's why I started to stream it, because I was like, I, don't, I really don't want to 
to not stream this because I kind of regret not streaming Dark Souls 2 um, because all that fucking game was super good. I really liked it. I'm kind of uh, upset I didn't stream it for my first time reaction, but it's all good because we'll get it in there. I'll do a Dark Souls 2 stream eventually. I beat it. Tw my last character, I was like, I'm gonna say level 200 something. So it definitely, uh, definitely isn't as hard once you play it through the second time. So, and honestly, people say like sorcery makes the game a lot easier, but I, I wouldn't say I beg to differ completely, um, because it does make it easier in some cases, but. God, I was able to run through it in a strength build compared to my sorcery build. I was, maybe it's because I wasn't scaling it right or something, but I felt way more overpowered when I was doing my strength build. Let's see, nothing over here. Oof. We just knocked that dude off the edge, so rest in peace, that guy. Oh shit. That fucking dude scared the hell out of me. Get out of here. Launch your bitch ass off the edge. Okay, let's see. Ember, let's get it. Excuse me. Let's head over this way. I know there's a dude over here that we're probably gonna die to. And we don't even really need the weapon that uh, he ends up dropping, but... I just wanna kill him. I don't even know if he gives us any soul or many souls either, but you know we're just gonna do it for the hell of it. All right, let's do a little, a little roar, and then let's see. This guy can be a pain in the ass. Yep, already not doing good. Come here, bitch. I'm gonna wait for him to do this move. Come on. Oh my god, of course he hit me. Damn it. I don't know. Come at me, bro. Come on. Alright, do it so I can roll away. Barely doing any damage to him. No! No! When he starts doing that shit, it's so hard to escape from it. We almost got him, come on. No! No! Fuck, dude! I was doing so good, too. This motherfucker, I don't know why he's so fucking strong. Maybe I should have upgraded it a little bit before. I did that, but that's fine. We we got him. Kind of kind of got his move set down a little bit. Not really. I say I do, but I honestly don't. It's okay. We could try to parry him, but honestly, I'm really bad at parrying in this game. Like really fucking bad. Okay, he's actually a lot easier than I fucking thought. I didn't realize we could just like walk up to him most of the time. Come on. Come on, do it. Yes, sir, there we go. Easy. Alright, so we got that dude. It was no problem. I didn't even see how many souls he gave us. Seems like he gave us maybe like a thousand. I don't know. Not too bad, though. Got a couple embers so we can use those if we need. And, uh, yeah. I actually really fuck with the embers. Like, they definitely are a lot better than humanity in both the games. It's like humanity, but plus. I don't know if that makes any sense. Okay, let's talk to her. Raise the queen, yes, sir. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. 
Thank you. I'm a firekeeper. I tend to the flame and tend to thee. Yes, sir. The lords have left their thrones and must be delivered to them. Mm. No. I am at thy side. All right, let's go. Then touch the dark cake nourishment. So, I don't know what spat. I don't know what stats are good to go with first, but um, I just like to get vigor up. So we're gonna do vigor to twenty, and then we're gonna do the rest in strength for right now. And then uh, next I'll probably do endurance and uh, vitality and strength. I don't know, honestly. I'm just gonna scale and we'll see how what it ends up being. We I haven't really gotten any weapons when I did play that I thought to scale up or anything like that. So for right now we're just using the axe. Let's see what you got. Well you're not alone. We unkindled our Not fucking worthless, we're gonna become the final boss. And it have us seek the lords of Sindon and return them to their molding thrones. Hmm. But we are talking true legends with the metal to loot the fire. Not fit to look them. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay. Do you think? Shut up, bro. It was all sad and shit. Do we have more than one Titanite chunk right now, or shard? How do I check? No, we only have one. For some reason, this bitch ass makes this. It's fucking Andre from Dark Souls One, but for some reason, he has a grudge with us now and makes us pay fucking double for our shit. So we have to use two Titanite shards. Whatever reason, um, I think. Wait a sec. He made me. I remember he had me do three. Do you know anything about bosses in this game? Absolutely not. Just the just the frost guy. That's it. Every everybody else, I've been keeping my eyes off of anything on YouTube or anything like that because I've been wanting to experience it firsthand. Dark Souls Two was a bit of a different story, but that game was a pain in the fucking ass. So this game actually seems like it's a little bit more forgiving. Um. I'm not gonna use it. Well, maybe we'll use an ember right before we go back, but yeah. Let's see. How many embers do we have? We only have two. Okay, never mind. We're just gonna boss it. You already know how it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'll do that in a sec. Quit calling me Ashen One. It's just as bad as calling me Tarnished. I don't think she has anything that we really want. Um. Healing stuff, I mean, she has some ember in that. There's that key to the tower behind the shrine, but it's hella fucking expensive. Um, the halberd seems alright. It needs like 12 decks, I don't really want... I mean, we're probably gonna have to scale decks a little bit, but... I mostly want a big ass thing. Dark Souls 2 becomes so much better if you have... No, for real, I literally... Played my, when I played my mage build, I didn't upgrade that at all, and I was struggling so much. But when I did my strength build... I fucking had that shit up hella high. Like, not in insanely high, because most of my stuff is in strength. But, um, yeah, adaptability I had at maybe, like, 30. I don't know what the caps were. I know, like, there are certain states where, like, it would make it better. Um, I heard something about, like, level 28 being good, but I think I had it at, like, 30. Um, because I had my strength hella high. I had that shit at, like, fucking 90 or some shit. Um, but, yeah, she doesn't really have anything that we want at the moment, so... We're just gonna tell her to fuck off and... Head to... I forgot what the name of the place is, because I, when I, again, when I played it, it was like 3 in the morning. I had just gotten paid, I had work the next day, and I was just like, I'm just gonna play for a little bit. Let's see. So, we're going to the High Wall of Lothric.